investigation continues into what caused last week's explosion in the East Village. Attention now turning to those displaced by the blast. They need help in the form of donations. We're talking about everything from clothing to sheets to pillows, and they lost everything when the buildings came down. Sharon Crowley joining us live now from the East Village with more on that tonight. Hi, Sharon. Hi, Derry. Well, 60 apartments, as many as 60, had to be evacuated when this deadly blast happened. And in the days since this tragedy happened, this community has really come together to help one another. Mildred Guy tries on a winter coat for size. A lot. She needs clothes now and everything to set up a new home. She lost all her belongings last week when the building next door, 121 Second Avenue in the East Village, exploded and collapsed. Fire spread to her apartment building where she has lived for 45 years. It also had to be demolished, and as you can see, nothing is left but rubble and debris. Luckily, she was not home when the fire started. When I think tears just start crying, uh, coming down. Um, and I think, I think it was a great idea when my son said, you got to go to a family member or something. You cannot stay by yourself because he was just uh, too much. It was so too much. Volunteers at Mildred's Church, the Church of the Nativity, started collecting clothes and household items to give to her and all the residents who lost their homes or had to evacuate. We decided to do this clothing drive on Sunday, and the response was overwhelming. It was super inspiring. We had more than 40 people stop by with multiple bags. Crews are still at the fire scene, trying to find evidence and clues as to what caused this gas explosion. Mildred has lived in a rent-stabilized apartment here in the East Village for most of her life. Her biggest fear now, she will not be able to afford to stay in this neighborhood. I moved in there with my mother five for my sister, my, my brother, so we live there. A lot of memories. A lot of memories that, that cannot be replaced, but what's important is here. This is my family and myself. And Mildred's son is trying to help his mother. He set up a GoFund account. In fact, a number of the people who were evacuated here from the East Village have done the same thing to try to raise a little money to get a new start. And as for the church, the Church of the Nativity, they will be giving away clothes tomorrow from noon till about four in the afternoon if anyone is in need. A